Okay, so onward with the lymphatic system and the devices you see here that you can order off the net which will enhance the operation of the lymphatic system in times of need. A reminder, the following is my opinion only and is not to be construed as medical advice of any kind, nor am I speaking on behalf of the manufacturers of these devices. This audio, the ones before it and the ones to come, are for entertainment purposes only and are the ramblings of a stark raving mad lonely twisted mind if you value your sanity flee now all right now that we have that out of the way what you see here is a very common device that can be ordered off of the internet in various forms and functions this device basically generates a positive offset square wave its power output varies from manufacturer to manufacturer but since we are looking at this device from an entirely different point of view and function than the manufacturer had intended when they built it, we will shortly come to understand that even a very low power basic unit such as you see here will suit our needs quite nicely. We know from our previous lymphatic system audios that energy will move lymphatics, but did you know that it only takes a small amount of energy to stimulate the lymph tissue and therefore move lymph fluid? In fact, you can generate enough of this energy with just your fingertips, and I have demonstrated this technique publicly more than once. The technique of using a light stroking motion with your fingertips across, uh, for example, an individual's neck, back, or lower back, which in turn will pull fluid out from between the cells. Now this allows oxygen to be introduced, and when muscles get ample oxygen, they are more likely to stop cramping and relax. Now this reduces muscle pain and spasms than that an individual might be suffering from. In just a few minutes of using a light stroking motion across the subject's skin and accelerating the flow of lymphatic fluid, you can watch their actual skeletal structure readjust as the once oxygen deprived and cramped muscles relax due to increased oxygen in the cellular environment and bones that were once pulled slightly out of place resulting in aches and pains are allowed to move back into their ideal positions and we can help take away those aches and pains. If fingertips can produce enough energy to move lymph fluid then it's obvious that a device like this can do the same thing. Manufacturers know that the majority of the buying public are not familiar with the lymphatic system so instead the makers of these devices concentrate their ad copy on the claimed virus killing, bacteria killing, fungus killing abilities of a device that outputs a positive offset square wave. As to these claims I will only say that you cannot kill a virus because it is not alive in the first place. It is just a strip of genetic material but you can prevent it from attaching itself to your cells. Bacteria make up a very large percentage of our bodies and going on a quest to kill every last bacteria in our body simply means killing ourselves. An example of this would be uh, fungus or candida which is beneficial and life sustaining when in balance. In this audio we are only looking at this device's ability to generate very low amounts of electrical power which in turn will accelerate the flow of lymphatic fluid. The copper contacts you see here are placed against the skin and you will feel a stinging sensation after it is held in place against the skin for longer than a few minutes. Simply move the device one inch in either direction and the stinging sensation will go away but will likely return repeatedly so you have to keep moving the device in different directions across the skin. In my opinion only do not place these devices on the skin above the neckline or you may experience disorientation or vision irregularities as the device interrupts the electrical signals going to and from the eyes and the brain. If you do not have a brain then you can leave the device on as long as you wish but you may not notice any appreciable difference in the level of your health. Contrary to many promoters and users of these devices, I consider these to be for occasional or emergency use only and not to be used 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. 
Copper jewelry and devices with copper contacts such as these can leach copper into the skin up to 3 to 6 milligrams per day. This copper will then build up in the brain and the body does not have the natural facilities to expel this copper easily. Over a period of time, this copper buildup in the brain can cause depression. If you are desperately looking for a solution to a health issue, then you do not need a secondary cause of depression in your life. You might want to research the effects of zinc on detoxing copper from the brain, and you can do that using Google. If you wear bracelets that are made out of brass and you feel that this information does not apply to you, I will simply say that copper is a major component of brass. Square waves also do not exist in nature. Objects in nature do not jerk back and forth suddenly. Instead, you will see gradual cycles, rolls, circles, and waves, like the sine wave produced by ocean waves, sound waves, and light waves. These are rolling waves with roller coaster like highs and lows, not the sudden sharp square waves or the clipped top pyramidal waves produced by these devices. And that's the reasoning behind the use of these devices. Since they produce a waveform that does not exist in nature, and since the energy will cycle on and off incredibly fast every second, every minute, these little guys that uh, you may be attempting to eliminate from your bodies will have no defense against this square wave pulse. They cannot adapt to it and therefore are stunned, inactivated, neutralized, and then destroyed. However, I personally feel that these are of great value when used sparingly and these devices will stimulate the flow of lymph fluid wherever this device touches the skin you will find lymphatic fluid flowing in an accelerated manner. Because this device has the ability to move lymph fluid, it will be very helpful when we have an injury to our body, such as a sprained ankle or wrist, or even a broken arm or leg. When the cells of the body are physically traumatized by blunt force trauma, toxins, heat, or any other cause, the damaged tissue will release chemicals including histamine, bradykinin, and serotonin. Now these chemicals will trigger the tiny holes in the blood capillaries that we talked about way in the beginning of the series. It will trigger these tiny holes to open much larger than normal and therefore fluid will rush into the affected area creating swelling and further pain. Then of course inflammation will eventually lead to fibrosis which creates a weak area that nanobacteria can make a home in which causes more inflammation and the cycle repeats all over again. Now these chemicals bradykinin, serotonin, and histamine also are a signal to white blood cells to go ahead and swarm the area and consume any microorganisms and dead or damaged cells which will then leave pockets of pus in their wake. Using these devices will not only accelerate the flow of lymphatic fluid resulting in reduced swelling, but will also clear out the fluid so oxygen can aid in the repair process and the offset square wave will help to sterilize the area as well, preventing opportunistic infections from gaining an unfair foothold at the area of injury. Please understand that using these devices as a cure-all will only delay the inevitable. If you have a chronic illness, simply using a device such as this to cure your health issues is a short-sighted solution at best. Remember, the underlying cause of why you fell ill in the first place will still remain, no matter how much you use a device like this. If your channels of elimination, the bowels, liver, kidneys, lungs, skin, if these are clogged up or working in a sluggish, substandard manner, then you may see temporary relief from the symptoms you are dealing with, but the true cause remains intact and ready to create health issues at another weak point in the body at any given time. Get a strong, sound foundation, restore balance, and the odds will shift in your favor. All right, that's it for the first device, and we're going to move on to our second uh, device that you can order off the net, which will accelerate the flow of lymphatic fluid.